There's a class I take in my school called um, Enduring Issues in Film, where I watch movies based on historical events. And the first movie we had to watch in that class was Miracle, because Miracle is based on true events that happened in the 1980s. It says in the back that um, the U.S. was going against the Soviet Union for hockey, and because at the time they wanted to be better than them, so one of the things they wanted to be better at them, you know, like one of the things they wanted to be good at was, I guess, hockey, because I guess pe people in Russia, you know, like hockey. And at the time, I did not know I owned this DVD. But now that I do, I can show you all the goodies in it. This comes with old stuff from the year I was born. Disc 1 is obviously the movie, but Disc 2 comes with a whole bunch of stuff like um, outtakes, a featurette, um, ESPN thing, a behind the scenes featurette, first impressions, and all that stuff. It also comes with a DVD guide that shows you like what scenes are in the movie, like as you can see. And yes, that is Tag from Friends. He was in this movie as... Someone will we'll still call him Tag for now because that's all I remember him for. And, uh, yes, uh... Kurt Russell is in in this movie. He plays the coach, Herb Brooks. And you might know Kurt Russell for Santa in the Netflix uh, movies. And you may also know him as Mr. Nobody in the Fast and Furious 7, 8, and probably 9. I, I don't know. He might be in that, too. So, yeah, Miracle is based on uh, true events, 1980s hockey. It's They have all the characters in it, played by different people. Um, and it's genuinely actually a pretty good hockey movie. Is it better than Youngblood? Unfortunately, I'm going to have to say yes because of just how good it is. And the fact that I've this is... Disney made this, by the way, so I, I couldn't believe that Disney made this. It is PG, but it says for some language and rough sports action. I couldn't believe Disney, like, let some of the things they said in this movie slide. Like, it was just genuinely a pretty good movie. And one of the reasons why I wanted to do movie reviews... Well, actually, not really... Technically, I was still doing movie reviews regardless. I just, this inspired me to do it more. And I really think you guys should watch it. If you have Disney+, Plus, it's on Disney+. Plus. If you own it on DVD somehow, great, watch it on DVD. But, um, that's all I'm gonna say about the movie Miracle. Uh, the next movie I'm reviewing is Rumblefish. I do not own the book. I might get the book someday. So, Mom, Dad, if you're watching this, I need another S.E. Hinton book. Uh, I just need another one. Also, isn't it weird that... The Outsiders cast members starred in other S.E. Hinton books. Like Matt Dillon and Tex and Rumblefish and Emilio Estevez and that was then, this is now. And I think that's it. I might go see if they were in other movies from S.E. Hinton. Isn't it also weird that she allowed the Outsiders TV show to get made? How can you allow a monstrosity like that to be made? That's like when the Bill and Ted live action series. I'm, I'm rambling again. I just... Just end the video. God, Jesus. 